Heavily pregnant Meghan Markle shows off large bump on Birkenhead visit with Harry. The Duke and Duchess trip to Merseyside included going to Hamilton Square, tomorrow's Women Wirral and the Hive Wirral Youth Zone. Pregnant Meghan Markle is showing off her large bump as she and Prince Harry begin their first official engagement of 2019. Meghan, who today told fans she is six months pregnant, is looking vibrant in a bright red coat by Centaur with a purple babbitton by Aritas a dress underneath. She has teamed her outfit with matching red stilettos and a little brown handbag, with her hair and her signature classic bun. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are in Birkenhead, Merseyside, to learn about a number of organizations that support and empower groups within the local community. On their walk about the town, the Duchess even asked fans for a name suggestion if the baby is a girl, and liked their recommendation Amy, according to the Liverpool Echo. She told fans that's a great name. Meghan also reportedly revealed her due date is around April, as she and Harry worked the crowds. Meghan and Harry's first stop was Hamilton Square, where they viewed a new sculpture to mark the 100th anniversary of war poet Wilfred Owen's death. The statue, by artist Jim Whelan, is entitled Futility after one of Owen's poems. Video footage shows fans screaming Meghan as the royal couple unveil a plaque to go with the sculpture. Together, the couple lifted a purple sheet off the plaque as people cheered. The sculpture is cast in bronze and represents an exhausted World War I solider. Hundreds of people lined the streets to welcome them there, and fans were pictured earlier this morning already waiting. Fans gushed over Meghan and gave her bunches of flowers. The royal couple also received a giant teddy bear during the walkabout, as they chatted to fans of all ages. Meghan couldn't seem to keep her hands off her growing baby bump as they walked around, and appeared glowing and smiley. Meanwhile, a young fan held a sign up for the Duke of Sussex saying, Gingers unite, I love you Harry. Eliza Morris, 4, was in Birkenhead today with her 25-year-old mum Rosie. Meghan and Harry then visited tomorrow's Women Wirral an organization that supports women in vulnerable circumstances and helps them make positive lifestyle choices and changes. It was set up in 2011 to support women on their release from prison, and now offers a range of training courses and workshops for more than 6,000 local women, including support groups around mental health issues, domestic abuse and addiction. The organization is committed to reducing female imprisonment, offending, and to provide assistance to women who want to change their lives for the better. Meghan said she was inspired during the visit. Harry and Meghan heard from some of the women about their experiences. Finally they visited the Hive Wheel Youth Zone. The Hive aims to provide a safe environment for young people to help them build key skills and raise their aspirations and confidence. Meghan and Harry appeared delighted to watch a performance by some of the kids before chatting to some of the youngsters. A 19-year-old told Meghan and Harry she has struggled with her mental health after losing her dad. The royal couple were touched by her story, the Liverpool Echo reports. Harry said, Once you've been through something hard yourself you never want other people to go through that again. Meghan added, Your story is so important and inspiring and you've done so well. Harry thanked her for sharing what she'd been through with others. Ahead of the visits, Kensington Palace had tweeted, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will visit Birkenhead on Monday, January 14. Their Royal Highnesses will visit a number of local organizations that support and empower groups within the local community, including Tomorrow's Women and the Hive East.